victoriawilderness.com. I just thought I'd bring you on here today. I am at it again with the solar oven. Um, I am. I enjoy making chicken breasts, um, boneless, skinless chicken breasts, uh, done up real slow, uh, cooking time um, for a long period of time. They get really, really tender, really juicy, and we use them in sandwiches or in other dishes. So I thought today with the beautiful sun that we're having that I would utilize the sun oven and see how it fares for doing a using it as a slow cooker. Uh, is basically what I'm going to do here today. Um, it's like, I'm not sure, 10 o'clock this morning. So um, they're going to cook all day out here. I want to see how, how this works out for me. Um, so I will continue to bring you back on here and show you. And I'm just going to um, spin this around real quick and point out a couple things for those of you that didn't see my uh, chocolate cookie cake or chocolate chip cookie cake uh, recipe and uh, video. So uh, stay tuned a second here. Okay, I will also include a link in this um, video for the previous one so that you can get more information on this. But this is the All-American Sun Oven, and um, it is currently lined up to the sun. Uh, you can tell that because the light is shining through this hole and lining up with that hole. And you want to just move this with the sun um, so that it gets the best um, sun for uh, uh, consistent cooking. Um, so you have your cooking area and you have your uh, thermometer and I'll just step back here so you can see what this looks like. Um, it does have a leg on the back which is to be able to elevate it up and down so that it is with the sun the best that it can be and uh, it also has two anchors on that um, that you can use to put into the ground. Since I made my um, solar oven kitchen out here and my potting table. I'm going to actually use power cord on windy days and just uh, strap that to the to the table itself. Um, but a great, great item. Very pleased with uh, what we've made in it so far and um, look forward to sharing uh, the different dishes that I'm going to be uh, making in here. I will be making a sourdough bread this week as well. So stay tuned and uh, I'll show you how this turns out. Enjoy your day. Okay guys, um, Sun has left the area for today and dinner is ready. So um, the chicken turned out really fantastic. I'm going to pull it out of here. I wanted to just point out to you, remember, um, although this is cooking with the sun, when you open this up, everything is going to be hot. So make sure that you're using hot pads and stuff to get your food dishes out of here. It is going to be hot. I mean, your stuff, your food is boiling. Um, I think it maxed today around 250, 275, something like that. <clears throat> but this has been uh, cooking since about 10 o'clock this morning. It is now, I think it's after 5.30, so closer to 6 o'clock. So it's been cooking for a while. I like to cook our meats uh, long um, and on low heat, so this worked out really perfectly. Um, so bear with me a second here. I'm going to shut this off and pull this out and show you how the chicken turned out. guys I'm back on here um, I just wanted to let you know we are going to be doing a lot more um, outdoor activities uh, in a bit here and one of the things that I will continue to be doing is sharing um, the solar cooking I will be doing sourdough breads and all kinds of things in this this summer to show you how easy it is to utilize the Sun as a resource for your cooking to save um, additional uh, utility bills for propane and and electric um, so Stay tuned. We will also be doing a lot with gardening and um, our bees and various other things. So stay tuned. Check out our website at treyerwilderness.com. Subscribe to our newsletter. Um, I'm working on an uh, e-book that will be available for subscribers only. So we encourage you to join our newsletter so you can get that e-book. It's actually a cookbook. And um, be sure to continue checking for videos. We'll have a lot coming out uh, this summer. So thanks again for joining me, and I hope you got something out of this today. And until next video, God bless.